<laughs> we start in Detroit Rock City. Wait, oh, fuck, sorry. Did you like blew Yo, it out and then <laughs> that was hey, the best whoop ever. The momentum is awesome. That first whoop was just fucking, fucking killer, dude. Hank throws a banana peel. How in front could of you us. do that? We start in Baltimore, where the game opened up with Devin Duvernay running like a racehorse for six. Lamarty Gras Jackson took the top off the defense and showed them some TDs. We start across the pond where Prince Andrew Dalton wasn't sweating. And in a touching tribute to my dear deceased friend, Queen Elizabeth, the referees were showing a lot of love to their cousins. The game came down to the leg of Sir Kicks-a-Lot as Will, I like Big Lutz and I cannot lie, attempted to take it into overtime. But the upright pulled the J.R. Smith and asked the Saints, you trying to get the pipe? Which they answered yes, twice, with a double doink. Cody Parkey, you are officially redeemed. Just kidding, I fucking hate your guts forever. Vikings 28, Saints 25. What? We start in Detroit Rock City where the Lions were feeling soupy as Ramen Ra St. Brown started hot but then cooled golf as their coach had a brain full of Dan Campbell's chunky chicken noodle soup after calling for an inopportune onside kick. Speaking of chicken, Miles Colonel Sanders was playing chicken, but Boston Market Scott had a side of mashed patities as everyone was expecting a Russian attack from the Eagles. In a matchup between two big coaches, Dancy Reagan Campbell gobbled Ronald Reagan Rivera's D right up. Amon Bra St. Brown looked like C Cup as he dropped a fat pair in the commander's end zone. Up to Baltimore, where, in a touching tribute to my good friend Liz, Big Trust was in the news despite having a vote of no confidence in Lamar Lament. Chief Justice Hill had a fumble recovery as John Harbaugh reinforced his lifetime appointment as Ravens head coach. Suss Edwards ate up the man-to-man D, scoring twice on the way to a Ravens victory as the usual Gus Becks are at the top of the NFC North. Whap, 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 whap. Some spread. The Texans were all lost in the supermarket as Eckler scored twice. General Mills attempted to hook up with Raisin Brandon Cooks and Checks Burkhead with a side of O.J. Howard for breakfast. But it was Bryce Krispies Callahan and the Chargers D who had other plans. In the Meadowlands where Daniel Crone said, let's get this bread as the Giants are number two and O. Oh. Matt Gruel and Quaker Mayfield have Panthers fans demanding a little more flavor. Say rich homie Quan Barkley has Giants fans feeling some type of way, restoring the glory of the 80s with a day ball of Coke and Lawrence Taylor highlights. The G-Men take down the Kitty Cats 19 to 16. The G-Men are two and oh! Pat Trick Daddy Mahomes got in a fight with his offensive coordinator and said, if you want it, you can get it. Let me throw. Lil John Taylor put up 71 yards, and the Chiefs lose to the winless Colts. What? Lose to the winless Colts. What? Lose to the winless Colts. What? The Detroit Lions might be good. Huh? Jaguars 38, Chargers 10. Huh? Huh? The huh? Jaguars 2 and 1. Huh? Mike McDaniel had a farm. They are 3 and 0. Oh. And on that farm he had a duck. They are 3 and 0. Oh. With a waddle here and a waddle there and a waddle here and a waddle there. Old Mick Mike McDaniel had a farm. They are 3 and 0. Oh. Davis, can you pay my mills? Can you pay my automobile mills? I don't think you do. So Houston's going to lose. The Raiders' offensive backfield was working at the car, Josh. Working at the car, Josh, yeah. The... Raiders 38. The Texans 20. The Jaguars scratch out the... Raiders.
Raiders on way to a victory. Jack 27, Las Vegas 20. You okay, Boom? The Browns chubbed up with a Kareem pie as their tandem scored three times and add another from when the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie. That's Amari. Speaking of Amari Cooper, JC Michael Jackson was bad. He's bad. He's really, really bad. And treated Amari Cooper like he was an elementary school playground, staying 500 feet away from him at all times. In Foxborough, where it might sound crazy what I'm about to say. Bailey, he's here so Bill can take a break. He's got a rocket arm that can throw to space with the air like I don't care, baby, by the way. Because I'm zappy crap along if you feel like taking the top off the defense roof. Because I'm zappy crap along if you feel like Bailey is the truth. Because I'm zappy crap along if you love the QB from WKU. Because I'm Zappy. Clap along if you feel like Bailey made the defense to do. Zappy, 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 Zappy. Zappy. The Patriots 29, the Lions goose egg. The Browns needed to be perfect offensively as Bailey sang. All my life been thrown, but it really don't matter no more. And they wonder why we act this way. Zappy Root's gonna be okay. Oh no, hell no. Y'all done up and punted. All the Browns' nickelbacks couldn't stop England's rushing attack, saying, This is how you remandre. Some spread. Some spread. Out in the NFC Westminster Abbey, where the king's buried, if you want to see the queen, you're going to have to look up to the sky more. And Juju Smith-Schuster was coughing the ball up. But if you're looking for pallbearers, you might want to get six Cardinals because they're sure to let you down. Greg Dortch. Huh? 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 Went torched earth in a losing effort as the Chiefs defense had Kyler Murray with no aim assist in the gulag, running around with no plates. Learn from the lost failures. Fail is a proper teacher. Chiefs 44, Cardinals 21. To rainy Philadelphia where the weather had people saying, Jamal Agnew, as the Jaguars jumped out to a hot start. I would walk 500 miles, Sanders rushed for it to close it, and the Eagles dug Peter's son, their former head coach. In Detroit, where Jer Him Goff went up against Kirk cause him. It was a battle of elite skill players, as well as just him, Jefferson, and Adam Feel him battled against a him bra St. Brown and Dia him Swift. The Himasota Vikings no longer have Mike Himmer as head coach, but their new guy, Kev Him O'Connell, is up to the challenge. The game came down to the final minute, and KJ Osborne caught a touchdown for the win. Vikings 28, Lions 24. Speaking of hymns, two of the greatest hymns faced off in Tampa Bay as Aaron Rodgers and Tahem Brady battled for what could be the final time. The Packers tried to pound the rock with A.J. Dillham, and the Bucks answered in kind with a heavy dose of Lenham Fournette. The game came down to the final two-point conversion as the Bucks had a delay him of game, and Russell Gage was unable to bring in the two-pointer. Aaron Rodgers afterwards implied that the Packers may have cheated with a jumbotron, and we are once again asking for him to be put in prison. What? 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 Tick, 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 some spread. Jalen Rager Mortis is back from the dead with a one yard touchdown as the Vikings were accused of necrophilia for fucking a dead team in the first half. Let's go down to the field with head coach Mike McDaniel for his first win in the NFL. Thanks, Mike. Dolphins 20, Patriots 7. In the afternoon slate, we head out west where quarterback Christian McCaffrey threw a touchdown as wide receiver Christian McCaffrey caught a touchdown and running back Christian McCaffrey ran for a touchdown? Oh, some game. Down to Dallas. It's a bird. It's a plane. It's Cooperman as Cooper Rush Limbaugh used his right wing to attack Joe Biden Burrow. Micah Allen Parsons Project has this Cowboys defense playing serious ball and Dorrance Lance Armstrong had double the sacks of his namesake. Mike Jenny McCarthy won't be singled out this week as Jerry Jones will surely be taking a trip to the glory hole. In Cincinnati where Joe Mixon a water scored a touchdown to start the scoring. 
Then Joe Richard Milhouse Mixon scored a touchdown as he said, I am not a crook. After that, the Bengals running back crossed the Joe Mason Mixon line for a score. And then Joe Mixon and Match switched things up with a receiving touchdown. Finally, Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, and Joe Mixon finished it off with another score. Wait, Joe Mixon scored five touchdowns? Down to Georgia, where Atlanta was feeding umbilical cord around Patterson, giving life to the Falcons' playoff chances. Khalil Mattress Max said fuck you to London, ripping the ball away and keeping the Falcons to 17 and under, just the way Drake likes it. The game took a crazy turn as pardon my take Juan Graham recovered a fumble, but in a touching tribute to my dear friend Henry Lockwood, he lost the ball. Game by fumbling it back. Has Hank ever won the lottery ball machine, Boom? He hasn't, Teach. Standing on a corner, Jameis Winston down in Nola, such a fine sight to see. It's Kyler, my lord, and he's looking adorbs, running like he stole my cell phone from me. You have to fight back, Saints fans don't like that. They're riding Gino off, he did it right back. Standing on a corner down in Winslow, Arizona, such a fine sight to see. Dirty birds, my lord, up on the scoreboard. And Jameis throwing to Mike T. Come on, Jameis. Thought you got sick. You better watch out. Don't get your vertebrae hit. Standing on the corner, Jameis Winston, Tampa, Florida. Such a fine sight to see. Joe and Jamar smoking another cigar in their first game back in New Orleans. Come on, Raiders, you're worse than the Gators. And the only bowl you'll be invited to is the one the barber used during the haircut that he gives for Mark Davis. Saints 24, the Raiders 0. Saints go marching.